another woman who knows her value and wants other women to realize theirs as well. That's the sweet spot. Lauren Wesley Wilson, CEO of Colorcom Corporation, a platform that addresses diversity and inclusion across the communications and media industries. She's out with a new book entitled, What Do You Need? How Women of Color Can Take Ownership of their careers to accelerate their paths to success. I love the title. And Lauren, in the book you say, the question, what do you need, is a really simple one, but not usually a question women of color get asked. Why is that and why is this so important? What's your message to them in this book? Well, good morning. Thank you for having me. I want Absolutely. women. I want women, I want us all to start asking the question to ourselves and to each other, what do you need? There are some basic needs as women that we need in the workplace. We need to be valued, seen, heard and understood, respected and compensated. And so that is why I wrote this book and I can't wait for folks to dive on in. All right. So, <laughs> Lauren, I had the great pleasure of co-hosting a book party for you earlier this week. And, it was so much uh, fun. Know, it was a lot of fun. I was, uh, I, I first of all loved the powerhouse co-host committee that you had put together. And one of the things that you, um, you know, spend a lot of time, you spoke a lot about the importance of women, of women of color supporting other women. But what do you tell young women? What are the four things you tell uh, young women of color as they're trying to establish their careers, build their businesses? Uh, curious for your advice for them. Yeah, I think we tell them that first, you need to know if this is an environment where you belong. If it is, you need to do good work. Let's start with that because so often we want the success and the accolades without doing the work first. So let's do that. You need to make a name for yourself, which is so important. And you need to build relationships. You need to build connections. You need to have the mentors, the sponsors, and this term I coined in my book called godmothers and godfathers in your corner. Lauren, I, I'm speaking as the editor of the 50 Over 50, our partnership with Mika and Know Your Values. So I'm curious, what's your advice for women over 50 who might have gone through their mm -hmm. whole career not asking themselves what they need? Because I, I just underlined, we need to ask ourselves that question. I think that's so important. What would you say to that demographic? It's not too late to start asking that question now. I was doing a talk yesterday in DC at AARP. And so many of the women had said there, you know, this book is for women over 50 as well, not just early careers. They read the book, they learned so much. And so you can start asking this question now and you can really define what you need at any stage of your journey. The new book is entitled, What Do You Need? And it's out now. Lauren Wesley Wilson, thank you so much for joining us for this Know Your Values segment. Maggie McGrath and Huma Abedin, thank you as always as well. And don't forget, everybody, nominations for Forbes and Know Your Values 50 over 50 list are open now. You can get all the details at Forbes.com or knowyourvalue.com and just keep in mind, think about those women on the basketball court. Do they ask someone to put the basketball in the basket for them or do they do it themselves? Nominate yourself. Just step up and nominate yourself for the 50 over 50 list. Hey everyone, MSNBC has a new and improved app. You'll get real-time alerts and analysis, live blogs, in-depth essays, video highlights, and the best 2024 election coverage. Download the new MSNBC app. Here's how to do it. You tap on the App Store on your phone. You hit search on the bottom right corner. You type in MSNBC. You click on the MSNBC app. You click on get or the cloud icon and enjoy it.